This segment is sponsored by the Utah Restaurant Association. Have you ever had steak served on a stone? Well, Katie Sign tried this on her Taste Utah Road Tour. Let's take a look. Taste Utah Road Tour. We're coming to you on a fresh living, and we're up in Myton, Utah. That's in Duchesne, and we're at the Hideout Steakhouse. This is an extraordinary restaurant, definitely food worth traveling for. I hear they're actually allowing us to cook steaks on a heated rock. I've never seen anything like this. I cannot wait to introduce you to the whole crew that is making this dining experience happen. Kitchen manager Todd, so steak is one of the things you do really well at the hideout, yes, yeah? Yes, that is correct. What are some of the other things on the menu? We have chicken, we have hamburgers, Yum. pulled pork sandwiches, a lot of smoked meats. Hearty meats. But steak is like your sweet spot. It's what yes. people know you for. What kind of steak do we have here in front we, of us? We have a 12 ounce ribeye. Ribeye. Okay, so you're making us a ribeye. And what's really unique and cool about what you do here is you allow the consumer to actually do the cooking. Yes. So you're going to season it up. and yeah, Okay, correct. awesome. So we use a garlic salt. Okay, lovely garlic salt over the top here. Just you do it on both sides? Yes, we nice. do. Nice. Okay. Yeah, look at that beautiful marbling. Where are you getting your steaks from? We we use stockyard steaks. Oh, I love that. Out of U.S. Foods. Yeah, wonderful. So. Such a great quality product. Yes, and they are the one of the best steaks you can get. It's just amazing. The garlic smells so fragrant. Yes. Anything it, else that goes on here? Nope, that's it. Okay, and so now what's our next step? The next step is we come over to the stone oven. So you pull out a hot stone. Yes, okay. it is over 600 degrees. Oh my gosh. So you've got one. You just place it down right here. That is correct. And, oh, it's like smoky. We take a little spray. Okay, throw it on a little spray because you don't want it to stick. Okay, nice. Just cool. polishing it all up. We add a little bit of sea salt. That helps add to oh, the flavor and help it cook it. a little better. So you're actually seasoning the stone. Yes, wow. that is correct. So we throw the steak right there. It's sizzling already. Give them a knife. All right. And then you wheel it out. Then so wheel I'm going to go sit out. You're going to bring this to me. And yes. I'm going to go sit with Kayla. We'll talk a little bit more, do some cooking. Yeah, that is Okay, great. I'll All see right. you in a sec. All right, here comes the steak. Whoa. Right in front of me. Oh, my gosh. Thank you. He's just... Taken and leaving. This is amazing. So basically, this process started in the back of the house. I was just back there. And now, you bring out these lovely sides. Tell me what we have in front of us. So right here, we have our cream corn, which we make in-house. They okay. make it every morning. And we have our homemade mashed potatoes with our gravy, and they make the mashed potatoes with real potatoes every morning, oh, too. I love this. We have multiple sides to order from, too. Salad bar. Salad bar, desserts. We've got cheesecake and our homemade ice cream, which we make two to three times a week. Oh, I mean, you're doing it. So I feel like I'm, it's time to flip this, and I just, like, <laughs> flip it with my own. Yes. Okay. Just use your fork and your Ooh. knife. Oh, look at that crust. This is amazing. This is like such a sear. And then I just kind of like, I can kind of cut my bites to order, right? Yeah. So like, yes. and it's all seasoned. I mean, I have to tell you, Kayla, this is beyond a dining destination. This is a food experience worth traveling for. So I feel like I'm just going to have to have a bite, yeah? <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You've got to get up here.